What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? These are not bad, bro. I'm here at Full Locker Hollywood and Highland as always. You know how we get down. They got the colorways here, man. They got the colorways. These 90s fives. I haven't seen these ones either. Let me know if any of these are copper pants for you guys. I mean, I'm telling you that the shoe selection here, Hollywood and Highland Foot Locker is always on point, bro. I'm trying to find out if we're gonna get the Just Do It's here or not. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. All of these shoes, man. It's a whole lot of fire going on in here, man. Always. Oh, these are those new Vapor Maxes. The new Vapor Maxes. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on these in the comment section below. A lot of people like them, some people don't. I think these are pretty fire, though. I think these are pretty fire. They got a lot of nice, nice colorways that are coming out in these. I don't see the ones that I saw online that I thought was fire, which is like that navy bluish one. But these ones are definitely on point. Look at these Vapor Maxes. I haven't seen these. Are these like a re-release of the multicolor? This is a different type of multicolor, my goodness. Cop pass, fire, or trash? Let me know in the comment section below. I think these ones are not bad at all, actually. What about these? Cop pass, fire, or trash? We need to know. We need to know. A lot of fire going on here, bro. A lot of fire going on. Vapor Max definitely doing their thing. Nike had a great 2018. It don't look like they stopping anytime soon for 2019. Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. You feel me? All right, for sure. Good looking out, man. I appreciate that, for sure. For sure. What do you guys think about these bad boys right here? Air Max Deluxe in a few different colorways. Out of the three that you guys see, which one do you guys like the most? This one's pretty ill. Something different. But let's go on and get over to what we came for, which was the Westbrook's Why Not .20. What are these? Look like those Eddie Jones, but they're not Zoom 2K. Let me know the thoughts on these, man. They got them in two colorways for $85 price point. It's like a dad shoe mixed with an Air Max TN or something like that. Out of the two colorways, I like that one probably the most. Let me know if you guys agree. They still have Super Bronze here. If you guys are in the LA area looking for Super Bronze, they still have them in a few good sizes. I talked to the people today. They have 12, 13, I think size 11 also. You gotta come here as soon as you can to get the shoe that you want. They still have the Halloween Kyrie Fours. Very dope shoe. A lot of people on the channel like these. They come, what is this, the Amarillo Kyrie Lowe's in a yellow colorway. Of course, that bottom's pretty freaky. But let's go on over here to these Westbrooks, bro. These Westbrooks. They doing them on display. Jordan 1s, Jordan 1s, Jordan 1s. They still have these bad boys right here, which are fire. I like the colorway, bro. I can't pull the trigger on them yet, but these are dope. I can't wait to see them go on sale, because they definitely will go on sale. Let me know who's copping those. They also still have the Mocha 3s on deck, if you guys are looking for Mocha 3s. I know we got a lot of people out there who actually like these, because they haven't came out since back in the day but to me too much a white shoe I already got one you feel me so it's like the same thing in my in my opinion I don't need too many more white shoes they're hard to keep clean as it is I'm being so iffy on the shoe itself I gotta I gotta make sure I'm good got the white flints the black flints on here we go in hand the Westbrook why not 0.2 0.2 let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below cop pass fire or trash 120 retail I heard they sold out online. They have limited sizes here. A lot of people have been coming in to get them. It's a bulkier shoe, it looks like, but it is very, very light. In my opinion, as I'm holding it in my hand, it's nowhere near as heavy as you think it would be. Let me know who's copping this shoe, who's passing this shoe. Like I said, I'm not able to get my hands on it. My finances are kind of crazy. I'm waiting for them just do it. Kyrie's also, and maybe them PG3s. But tell me what you guys thinking about this shoe. Who's copping this shoe, who's passing on them? Let me know. They got them on a nice display here. And it's definitely worth it. Let me know who's going out there to try to cop these or not. Cop pass, fire or trash, as I always ask in the video. These are pretty fire. These are the ADs. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? 
shine bright like a diamond. This is not bad though. I like the upper. The white midsole is not too bad. Look at that Air Max though, just gleaming. Just blinging. This shoe is pretty nice, man. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Pretty fire if you ask me. Look at that. Tell me what you guys think about these. These are the T-Max in the black colorway. They've actually had maybe three or four colorways already released, but these ones right here are pretty fire. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Very, very fire. The bottoms, the traction on here doesn't look too bad. I'm so glad T-Mac came back. T-Mac is one of them OG scorers, one of the boys in the league that have been doing their thing for a very, 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 very long time. I'm iffy about the price. Anytime you got 160, first thing that comes to mind is the Jordan 1. Is this on the level of a Jordan 1 or not? Let me know your thoughts and opinions on that in the comment section below. Of course, we had Club Foot Locker 2. And it's going to be crazy like a motherfucker. So I'm just trying to get in and out. These are still my favorite James Harden colorway. These ones and those blue ones they just dropped. Fire. Harden's collection, man, the MVP collection. Still here at Foot Locker Hollywood and Highland. Those shoes and these ones I think are pretty fire too. Never got my hands on these or kept these myself, but I definitely want to get a pair of these. These are pretty fire. Let me know what you guys think about those. Now I saw a picture of this one yesterday online. This is actually the Chinese New Year Ultra Boost. Let me know who's copping this one or going after this. This is Chinese New Year. A lot of shoes are coming out, a lot of different models in the Chinese New Year colorway. The only thing I see on here, resemblance of that, is maybe the inside, like the insole, and then the laces. Nothing else on this shoe really screams Chinese New Year to me, but the shoe is still pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below, you dig? Now, I've showed you guys this one before on the channel. That 3M is what making that colorway, but it's like a, a light pink or something like that. But it looks better in person, doesn't look as pink. But that suede on the whole upper, man, I think that's pretty fire for what they did with the suede. Let me know if you guys are feeling this shoe. What do you guys think about that 3M and the shoe as a general, as a general, <laughs> as a whole. That one's fire. And this one, that's not bad either. You got that suede on here. And without the light on it, it looks navy blue. But the light on it makes it a little bit lighter blue, like a royal blue 3M. I like when they do things like that. Let me know what you guys are thinking about these shoes in the comment section below. This is the Adidas section here at Hollywood and Highland. They got a lot of different shoes, but it's just about what you guys like. And it's not all of them, this is just a few of them. Today was a different day for me, bro. I really didn't even think I was gonna come up here, but it was a great thing I did. I ran into some good people, which I will talk to you guys about more when I get to the crib. I like these NMDs. These are very similar to the NMDs that I had before that I beat up and threw away in the trash. But these, once again, we are here on Hollywood Boulevard, the strip. We're gonna take a walk down here real quick just to see what's going on. See what you guys can see, see, see. I'm sure you guys would like to see some of the stuff out here in Hollywood. It is January, it is not so cold. Usually it would be, but it's pretty cool right now. So let's go down Hollywood and see what we're gonna see. Maybe go ahead and check out, uh, what is that place called again? Marshalls. But like I was saying, man, I didn't even want to come out here today because I was going to be, you know, I just wasn't feeling it. I didn't, I didn't have the funds to buy these Westbrooks today. I'm in between checks or whatever. Damn, I just saw a crazy distraction. But yeah, so I wasn't even going to come out here today, right? But it's a great thing that I did because I found out some things about some releases coming out. I found out that this Foot Locker will have a lot of shoes I'm looking for. They will get the All-Star 1, for, um, the All-Star 1s that come out All-Star Weekend. They gonna have the Just Do It Kyrie's. They got a few shoes that I'm looking forward to, which is good. And then I met one of the people that they use the Foot Locker all the time. They have this dude that's on their Instagram stories, the Foot Locker Instagram stories. I forget his name at the moment, but he's a junior. And he does the sneaker updates for these guys all the time. So I actually got a chance to talk to him and meet with him and actually helped him out. Um, he was doing some photos inside Foot Locker and he needed assistance. I was able to help him take some pictures for him. We exchanged Instagrams and then, you know, we're gonna see what's up. He gave me some good information on how to do what I wanna do for my next steps in this game. I come from a part of town where niggas stay armored down Where the bitches stay crowded down on the corner stay powdered down The undercover cops be planning on the knock me Ones. Look like some Yeezys. I got some of these. Let me see. What do you guys think about these? 
I got a couple things, some shocks, nothing crazy. Some of these Pumas, which I think are like Selena Gomez's Pumas. You got some Nikes here, look almost like some Kobe's, but they're not. It's Marshalls. Quick in, quick out. Now we're gonna go head on over to Shoe Pals real quick and then be out. Let me know what you guys are thinking about these in the comment section. I think these are pretty fire if you guys ask me. Look at the blue outsole, the blue clear outsole. You can see the barcode on these things. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on these. There's no 3M on it. Actually, the black part. Yeah, there is some 3M on the upper. Very, very nice. Suede going on, white midsole. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Pretty fire if you ask me. What do y'all think about these? Some lows or some mids, some Jordan 1 mids. Leather on here looks pretty nice. Then you got the Tinker Sixes right above it. Shoe Palace always has a great, a great selection, bro. Great selection. Got some pine greens, <laughs> pine green mid tops. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. We're here at Shoe Palace once again, but I'm actually about to take off because it's been a crazy morning so far. Got a lot of information. My brain is going crazy right now. Let me know what you guys think about this stuff in the comment section. Obviously, they got like a Hello Kitty Barbie thing going on. If you guys are into this at all, Hello Kitty themed shoes. <laughs> I'm not too sure if I'm a fan of this stuff, but maybe you are. Hello Kitty Air Max. Very, very dope layout, man. This Foot Locker and the Shoe Palace in Hollywood and Highland is always flames. They always got a great wide selection of different things. What is this? This is pretty nice for girls. Got the Barbie down the side. Who's feeling this? Ladies, let me know. Barbie 50. Wow. Barbie got her own shoe now. Okay. Pretty cool for what that is, but we about to get out of here. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Share the video so more people in the world can see your boy because we worldwide out here, international. And uh, I'll try to keep them on top with the bangers and the content. You guys just subscribe and watch. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. This has to be a return. Unless they got a late shipment of these. How many people are filling these, man? In the black colorway. I like this one. The red suede is pretty fire, too. The red suede is pretty fire, too. Let me know what you guys are thinking in the comment section below. Which one are you guys feeling a little bit more than the other? I love all the feedback, you dig? Let me know what you guys think about these, man. 50th and 50th anniversary, I guess, for Hot Wheels. I like this colorway, Puma Hot Wheels. Let me know if you guys are feeling this colorway out of the Puma Hot Wheels. They got a few different colorways. This one here, too. It's like this orange one. I think this one is pretty dope. Out of the three, because they have this one also. This one's not that bad, bro. This blue is pretty fire. I just like the other one a little bit more because it has more of that solid black with that gold. But this is pretty dope, man. Let's see what the outsole is. So Hot Wheels on the outsole. Let me know what you guys think. And they got three Hot Wheels colors. Out of the three Hot Wheels colors, which one do you guys like the most? And I would say this one is my favorite. Let me know what yours is in the comment section below. And once again, finally, we're actually about to take off now. I'll see you guys in the next video. Deuces. As you can see behind me, there's some type of production going on over here at the train station. I have no idea what they could be filming, but I will be on the lookout. It's just crazy when you see that sometimes they got a whole production set up guards and lights and all this stuff. It's gonna be interesting to see what it is. If I ever find out what it is, I will say, hey, I know what the commercial was about. Boom. But uh, about to head on over to Jamba Juice, then get to the crib. Juice. I came here and got my acai bowl. It's about to be lit. Let's get back to the crib now, man.